Hey Street Talks, what's up? This is Eric from the Eric from Street Photography Blog. So I want to share with you this notion I have of training. So I think one of the big issues is nowadays there tends to be too much of a focus on, you know, being genetically gifted or whatnot. And there's actually not enough focus on this notion of training. So what is training? Training means to keep practicing at something until you get good at it. And even when you get good at something, to continually strive to keep doing the thing you're good at or the thing you're passionate about. So now the, the reason why this is so interesting to me is this. Anything that you care about in life, you could get better at it as long as you train enough. So it don't matter what your genetics are when it comes to you know, lifting weights, but if you train for a long time, so let's say you try and you train anything every single day for a year or two, the amount of gains you'll make is gonna be epic. And I think this is where training, going hard, not being afraid, having courage, and um, like, I don't like the word consistency, but maybe it's just more of like to not break the chain, to be uninterrupted. So for example, my biggest gains in powerlifting happened to me in my deadlifts and whatnot, where I have the ability to lift at least once a week in my major lifts. And I've actually found that for myself. Um, my optimal thing is with deadlift, to try and attempt a one rep max PR every single week. And so actually even with lifting a certain uh, lift, whether it be deadlift, squat, whatever, is trying to attempt it at your maximum once a week. So let's say, so yesterday I deadlifted 450 pounds. Next week, whatever it is, next Wednesday or something, I'm gonna try 455 pounds. And if I don't get it up, that's cool, I'll just wait another week and I'll just keep trying it again. And so, to me training is so great because it's kind of like the notion that you work hard at anything, you get good at it. And to me that's the ultimate powerful notion because how much of us feel disempowered because we feel like, oh, I'm not genetically gifted or you know, I'm not born creative, blah, blah. But yo, every single child is born creative. I don't know one kid who don't like to play in the sand, to play at the jungle gyms, like to draw and stuff like that. And my thought is, we unlearn creativity, we unlearn that kind of like childlike sense of play and wonderment. And so even for myself, my personal goal is every single year, I actually try to become more childlike, which means I kind of want to devote my life to think about life like a, a sense of play. Is anything I'm doing, I'm just gonna treat it like my play. Even when I'm making these videos, I, I do it for fun. And I kind of set like these little fun, little arbitrary challenges for myself, which are totally nonsensical. Like, oh, I'm just kind of curious to see how, how many YouTube videos I can make in a day or whatever. Or even with powerlifting, my current goal is to deadlift 500 pounds for one rep. And it's, it's like, it ultimately doesn't matter. No one gives a shit, right? But for myself, it's to fulfill my own personal curiosity. And then once I've deadlift 500 pounds, which I know I could, I just need more time to train, then I'm gonna try like, you know, 550 and 600, 650, whatever. And I think probably the hard genetic limit for my deadlifts, let's say it's 700 pounds, whatever it is. But anyways. Know that with training, anything could be achievable. And I also think the way to approach training is don't do it because you need to somehow be a good person or virtuous to train at being better at, you know, maths or anything. Only train about things you care about. And I, I love this too, because if you train anything that you personally care about, you're gonna get better at it and you're gonna have so much more fun doing it. So even like I find with doing uh, videos and stuff like that and vlogging, Ain't nobody born to be a good actor. Just, you just keep practicing, you keep training, and the ultimate goal is for you to enjoy what you do. 
And so know that, so now my, my thought is this. It's kind of a funny thought. I don't believe in genetics. Genetic differences don't matter. Sexual gender matters, don't matter. Racial, ethnic things don't matter. It all comes down to training. And then just ask yourself, what do I want to train towards? And how hard will I go? Have the courage, you got this shit.